Hello, this is one more program of English by television presenting Follow Me. Estou super feliz de estar aqui com você, já treinando mais o seu inglês, chegando num ponto ideal de pronúncia e de fluência. E você me pergunta, Marisa, por que, que eu preciso repetir tanto as frases? Porque sabe que existem várias capacitações? Uma é ler. Você lê, aprende a ler e tudo mais. Isso é uma coisa. Escrever é outra. Para isso, você precisa copiar e falar. Para falar, você precisa repetir. E foi este o enfoque que nós demos desta vez no Follow Me. Parabéns, você está chegando na lição 41. Veja só. Lesson 41. Lesson 41. Ahá, parabéns! Cada vez você fica melhor. Vamos ver o Follow Me? Vamos lá. Is this and this? Let's have a look at this. Ah, this is interesting. A local man is starting a new theatre group. What do you do in your free time? Free time? I don't get any free time in this job. Hello again. You know what I do, don't you? I'm an actor. But what about you? Where do you work? What are you interested in? What would you like to do? Today's program is about those things. Here's a young girl, for example, who would like to do many different things. You were here last time I came. Was I? Yes, I've been here for two years. But you're looking for a new job now. Yes, I'd like to work in a hospital. Hmm. They're not very good, are they? Yes, I'd like to be a nurse. A nurse? I'm a nurse sometimes. Are you? They're quite nice. Have you got a brown pair? Yes, I think so. Or I'd like to work in an office. As a secretary? Yes. I'm a secretary too, sometimes. I'd like to be a teacher. They have nice long holidays. I'm a kind of teacher sometimes. But I don't get long holidays. Ah, here we are. Here's a brown pair. Hmm. Yes, I like them. Or do you think it's good to work in a restaurant? A waitress? Yes, I think I'd like to be a waitress. I'll have these. I'm a waitress myself sometimes. Do you like it? Not really. You're a waitress sometimes? Yes. And a nurse, secretary and teacher sometimes? A kind of nurse and secretary and teacher and cook and waitress and cleaning woman. I'm all those things. All those jobs at the same time? Where do you work? at home, as a wife and mother. Oh, I see. But there's one little problem. You don't get paid. I'd like to be a nurse. Where do you work? Está vendo só? Quantas profissões diferentes pode uma dona de casa ter? Tem algumas coisas para você no quadro. A professora também trabalha e muito. Veja lá. What do you do? What do you do? O que você faz? What do you do? Repeat. What do you do? Good. What would you like to do? What would you like to do? 
o que você gostaria de fazer. What would you like to do? Repeat. What would you like to do? Very good. Outra. You were here. Você estava aqui. Last time. Você estava aqui da última vez. You were here last time. Repeat. You were here last time. Yes, I've been here for two years. Veja este tempo de verbo. I've been. Eu estou aqui há dois anos. Quando você usa for two years, um tempo que ainda não acabou, em vez de dizer eu, eu estava, você diz I've been. Em vez de I was, I've been. I've been here for two years. Repeat. I've been here for two years. Very good. I'd like to work in a hospital. O que, que é esse de? I would. I would like to work in a hospital. Gostaria de trabalhar num hospital. I'd like to work in a hospital. Repeat. I'd like to work in a hospital. Very good. Continuando. I'd like to be a teacher. I'd like to be a teacher. Repeat. I'd like to be a teacher. Right. Aqui. They have nice long holidays. Ah, elas têm férias agradáveis e longas, que as professoras têm mais férias. Alguma compensação tem que ter. They have nice long holidays. Come on. They have nice long holidays. Repeat. They have nice long holidays. Very good. Continuando. Sometimes I think I'd like to be a waitress. O que, que é waitress? Waitress, garçonete. Sometimes I think, às vezes eu acho, que gostaria de ser uma garçonete. Sometimes I think I'd like to be a waitress. Repeat. Sometimes I think I'd like to be a waitress. Very good. I'm a waitress myself sometimes. I'm a waitress myself sometimes. Repeat. I'm a waitress myself sometimes. Quer dizer, eu também sou uma garçonete às vezes. I work at home as a wife and a mother. I work at home as a wife and a mother. Trabalho em casa como esposa e mãe. Repeat. I work at home as a wife and a mother. Come on. I work at home as a wife and a mother. Very good. Veja bem, à medida que você assiste mais de uma vez cada aula do Follow Me, você marca um ponto, você melhora seu inglês, sua pronúncia fica caprichada. Vamos assistir mais um trechinho? Follow me. Hmm. So you were there for four years. Hmm. Where do you work now? In Canterbury. I'm an electrical engineer, but I'd like to be a computer programmer. Hmm. That's interesting. Why? I don't know. Uh, there's a future in it. I think it's an interesting job and the money is very good. Hmm. Are you interested in football? Well, yes. I am. Wonderful game, football. Yes. Now, what shoes can I show you, sir? I like all sports and games. Oh, yes. Yes. Football, cricket, swimming. Can you swim? I'm not a good swimmer, but I go swimming sometimes. Tennis. That's a good game. Yes. I'm very interested in tennis. I never miss Wimbledon, you know. I see it every year. Oh. And what about running? The oldest sport in the world. Wonderful. One man trying to run faster than other men. Do you run? No. I just play table tennis and swim, and I walk quite a lot. Now, what kind of shoes do you want, sir? 
You don't play golf, then? No. I really like golf. Mind you, I like all sports. Games as well. You're a real sportsman, sir. Perhaps you want some uh, tennis shoes. Or running shoes. Uh, no. Football boots? No. I want some carpet slippers. Like those. Carpet slippers. Yes. I want to be comfortable when I'm watching television. Do you watch television? No, not much. I watch it a lot. You can see football and cricket, tennis, swimming, running, golf. I like watching television. Oh, I see. You watch sport on television. Of course. Wonderful thing, television. Yes, I'll have these. They're very comfortable. You know, my old school teacher was right. Sport is good for you. That's what he used to say. Remember that. I will, sir. Sport is good for you. Sir, your sports shoes, sir? My sports shoes. <laughs> Very comfortable. Are you interested in football? I like watching television. I'm not a good swimmer. Você viu? Ele pediu um sapato porque gostava de esportes. E no fim o que ele queria mesmo era assistir os esportes pela televisão. Olha só que preguiçoso, hein? Vamos ver o que tem no quadro. Veja só. Are you interested in football? Você está interessado em futebol? Are you interested in football? Vamos lá. Are you interested in football? Repeat. Are you interested in football? Good. I like football, cricket, swimming. Eu gosto de futebol, de cricket e de nadar. Swimming com dois M's. Aqui tem um, aqui tem o outro. To swim, swimming. I like football, cricket, swimming. Repeat. I like football, cricket, swimming. Very good. What about running? Dois N's aqui. Um N, outro N. What about running? Repeat. Come on. What about running? Good. Que tal corrida? Gosta de correr? One man trying to run faster than the other man. Um homem tentando correr mais rápido do que o outro homem. One man trying to run faster than the other man. Repeat. One man trying to run faster than the other man. Very good. I really like golf. I really like golf. Repeat. I really like golf. Golf. Very good. You're a real sportsman, sir. Sportsman é um homem dos esportes, um esportista. You're a real sportsman, sir. You're a real sportsman, sir. Repeat. You're a real sportsman, sir. Continuando. Perhaps... You want some tennis shoes. Perhaps you want some tennis shoes. Repeat. Perhaps you want some tennis shoes. Very good. I want some slippers to watch TV. Eu quero uns chinelinhos para assistir televisão. I want some slippers to watch TV. Repeat. I want some slippers to watch TV. Very good. Continuando. I'll have these. Vou levar estes. I'll have these. Repeat. I'll have these. Very good. Podemos continuar? 
Eu tenho mais um trechinho do Follow Me para você. Are you interested in swimming? Yes, I like swimming. I'm not a very good swimmer, but I like it. Good, you can write a report on the swimming match tonight. Oh. Now, uh, we'd like to know something about your hobbies. What do you do in your free time? Are you interested in the theatre? No, not really. I mean, what are you interested in? Well, I like football, mm -hmm. playing squash, uh, hockey. Are you busy? Not really. What are you reading? It's called The Red Arrow. Ah, they've made a film of it. Yes, it's on at the Rex this week. Oh. I'll see that then. You like reading, but uh, I like going to the cinema. I like going to the cinema too. All right, let's see the film together. <laughs> a carinha dele, acho que ele gostou da ideia. Vamos ver o que está no quadro, veja bem. Help me, there are men in my house, burglars. Help me, essa frase é boa, né? Help me, there are men in my house, há homens em minha casa, burglars, ladrões. Help me, there are men in my house, burglars. Repeat. Help me, there are men in my house, burglars. Very good. Outra frase. Come on. What are you waiting for? To wait for é esperar por. Come on. O que, que é come on? Come on. E aí? Vamos lá. Come on. What are you waiting for? E aí? O que, que você está esperando? Come on. What are you waiting for? Repeat. Come on. What are you waiting for? Very good. After you. Isso aqui é uma frase muito educada. After you. Quer dizer, passe você primeiro. Ladies first. Ladies first. After you. After you. É deixando alguém passar na frente. After you. Repeat. After you. Very good. Em seguida. You first. Você primeiro. You first. Repeat. You first. É bom ser muito educado, hein? Veja lá. That's Frank, my butler. O que, que é o butler? Butler é aquele empregado que é sempre o culpado dos assassinatos das mansões. O butler, o butler, o mordomo. That's Frank, my butler. Repeat. That's Frank, my butler. Very good. Vamos repetindo, vamos repetindo, assistindo o vídeo. É assim que nós estamos construindo o nosso curso de inglês. Follow me. Oh, my 
My name's Anne. Oh. Anne Travers. Pleased to meet you. I will give bread. After you, you go first. Oh, please. It's all right. There's no one here. They've gone. You can see more of the Red Arrow next time. For the moment, remember, I'd like to be a nurse. Where do you work? Are you interested in football? I like watching television. I'm not a good swimmer. Stay. Here? Stay with me. With you? All night? All night. Come this way, sir. I'll show you to your room. Clima tenso aqui no Follow Me. Lição 41 está no papo, você deve ver mais de uma vez, ela está na internet, o que facilita muito para você, está na Univesp, está na internet, está no blog, está no site, está em todos os lugares para você aproveitar cada vez mais as suas aulinhas de inglês. Na próxima aula, você é meu convidado especial, lição 42, lesson 42. Thank you so much. Goodbye.